party people. I have a Target haul for you today. What? I know it's been forever since I've filmed one of the, I, at least I feel that way. Mostly because, well, it's not anything super exciting or groundbreaking. You know what else I bet you're thinking? Oh, there goes Kim again in her long sleeves. Already sweating. <laughs> Whatever. I went to Target, I bought a lot of stuff. My Stroop Waffle bag, this one is my favorite bag ever. All right, per the usual, it's been a while since I bought some of this stuff. So I'm gonna have to dump it all out. What's in here? Smells good. So let's do that first. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, yeah, lots of cleaning stuff. I should share with you that I initially went for a birthday gift. I got the gift, you won't be seeing that unless I can show you here now. Which Target has like a whole section of Frozen 2 merchandise. When does that movie come out? It's gonna be a blockbuster hit. Or so everyone expects it to be because the first one was, you know what I mean? But are sequels ever better than the original? I mean, they never made a Chitty Chitty Bang Bang 2, I'm just saying. Ooh! One thing I am excited about. <laughs> One thing out of all of this crap. Okay, am I missing a bag? Ugh. Oh, two bags. <laughs> Ow! Where's the thing I'm excited about? There it is. My air conditioning just kicked on, hallelujah! But this is a maternity shirt and I figured fall is never going to happen in Florida so I have to pretend I have to wear all my fall clothes before I give birth, right? There's no logic. So I'm gonna share with you the things I'm most excited about first. <laughs> yes, Christmas stuff already! They only had a couple, I can smell this through the container. That can't be healthy. <laughs> they only had a couple of Christmas end caps, which I get it, it's not like October, I mean Halloween hasn't even happened yet. However, I am ready for it, if they're willing to put it out, you know? So they had a couple Mrs. Myers scents out. They have this Iowa pine, and then they had like snow storm or snowball or something. A big flop that one was. But this one is like a mild foresty scent, Iowa pine, if you will. So I definitely, I actually spotted this a couple weeks ago. I shared it on my Instagram and I was like, this is good stuff. But they only, at the time, had hand soap and dish soap. And I would prefer to have my hands not smell like Iowa pine. But when I'm cleaning and my house smells like this for hours after I clean, love it. I also got a foot mask, yes. Super exciting! I wasn't planning on getting a foot mask, but then Target said, hey, come look down this aisle. I think you're gonna want some of these things. <laughs> you know how Target talks to us. So, yes, my feet need a mask, and I'm sure, so it comes with like socks with some crap in it, and I'm sure I can just slather on some thick lotion on my feet and put some socks on, but this seems like it's so much cooler, right? A mask for your feet. I also got this. A series regular for my face and I bought this last time I don't know a few months ago at Target but the way that they bagged it this top was like off and half of the bottle spilled in my bag so it didn't last me very long because half of it spilled out and I didn't return it and some of you guys were like just exchange it Target will take it back but like it's not Target's fault that the cap was loose you know what I mean oh my gosh okay exciting stuff I forgot well exciting to me anyway okay seventh generation this stuff was on clearance I got some a lot of clearance items oh I also got a clearance really big bag of soil not so exciting and I didn't bring it in my house because I don't want soil all over the freaking place because I just cleaned my carpets no thank you you can keep that outside but I do need to like refresh my succulent soil is that a thing that people do on the regular I've had my succulents for almost two years, whoops! And the soil's like perpetually dry, barely holds moisture, so I'm like, okay. <laughs> I don't know, I'm not a very good plant mom. Back to this granite and stone cleaner. 
So this smells really good. The scent is Mandarin Orchard, and it's normally six bucks. I got it for four eighteen, and I gotta tell you, it's I love the smell. It's like citru citrusy, huh? And seventh generation, I think, is known to be like more natural. You know what I mean? I typically use a lot of method cleaning products, which I also snagged some method uh, window cleaner because I've been out of this for a long time and typically I clean my uh, like my sliding glass doors my mirrors and everything with just my Norwex like window cleaner I don't, it's like a cloth you just have to use water it's awesome but I do find sometimes it's helpful to have this stuff plus it smells good it smells like mint I think yes I was correct okay downward shift I was sitting on my feet not a very comfortable position all right Granite and stone cleaner. I'm here for it. I have granite. Nah, okay. And cold and flu season, my friends. I also found that. Wait. What? Huh? Did I not grab? Okay, I did. Ugh. I was looking for the clearance sticker. There it is. How much did I save? You don't know. It's blurry. Okay, here it is. I don't. How much was this crap? Normally five fifty. I got it for four sixty six. Not the best deal, but whatever. Since it is cold and flu season, no rinsing required. This is disinfectant spray. And when I shared this on my Instagram, a lot of you were like, "Yes, we love that." And then some of you, I want to say like two of you, so not some, a couple, were like, "That stuff is nasty." So I'm gonna spray it. We're gonna get my true reaction. <laughs> Doesn't really smell like anything. I mean, listen, I'm not a fan of Lysol. This doesn't really smell like much. Eh, okay, okay. It kind of smells like latex, like gloves, like the inside of gloves. Maybe. Yeah, it's definitely. Okay, oh, maybe it's the thyme that I smell. It's fresh citrus and thyme. This definitely smells better. I'm just saying. Uh, but I'm gonna use that for like door handles and stuff because it's cold and flu season. I'm about to have a baby A lot of people are gonna be coming in and out. I don't have a lot of time to clean, but I do have two seconds to spray, you know Oh my gosh, guess what else was on clearance this two little big lighters not little they're enormous They're usually 519. I got it for 258. Thank you. It's like summer clearance You know what was funny is of course I went down the candle aisle and I was sniffing all the candles and they had lighters on the end cap and Wentworth kept pulling them down He's like fireworks fire he associates lighters with fireworks Whatever anyway, he kept pulling them down and he kept putting them in the cart. I said no 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 We already have one at home, which we do a fancy one And then I saw this in the summer clearance and I was like it's literally the same thing for half the price I don't understand so I bought it. Oh my gosh. And, oh, okay. I went to Target for some boots. They have, what is it? Women's shoes or is it all shoes? Like 20% off on, oh gosh, what's their new thing? Not cartwheel anymore. It's called Circle. Whatever it's called, a rose by any other name. But their shoes are 20% off. So I was like, I need boots because my boots are like, couple years old and I was like you know what Kim just buy boots not that we really need them other than like two weeks out of the year where it's cool in Florida anyway I digress they did not have any in my size huh I was disappointed but I did find some shoes for Wentworth actually I think I picked up two pairs of shoes for him he's been wearing one pair Ugh. okay these are normally $30 I got them for $20 $21 but they're stride right and I feel like this is a good brand. I should start making him wear these before he grows out of them, okay? Get my money's worth. <laughs> oh, I got something for the baby! It's kind of like a boring something for the baby, but baby item nonetheless. Little socks. Eee! There's six little pairs of socks in here and I got all the same color. Cause I don't know about you, but I freaking lose baby socks, like losing hair on my head postpartum. So. It was very important for me to get all the same color <laughs> just in case one gets lost. Even Wentworth socks. I try I did buy socks for Wentworth too. I did try to find um some socks that were all the same color. They like didn't have any. That's not true. They did, but they were like a high ankle and I just don't want that. So I got some Cat and Jack socks for a little Wentworth. Some of them are neutral, some of them are stripes. But all of them are cool. Oh, you know what else I found on clearance? A couple things. But first I'll share with you a makeup item. <laughs> Gotta hype up that clearance. Uh, this was not on clearance. Lash Paradise. 
I have not bought this in a really long time and I need new mascara. My mascara is drying out. I typically use CoverGirl Lash Blast. That's not right. CoverGirl Super Sizer. It's the turquoise tube. Love it so much. I also really love the Lash Paradise. However, this dries out really, really quickly. Like really quickly where I think, oh, it's not even worth the money. It dries out so fast. But I thought, eh, I've got some money to waste. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I don't, but I did. I'll use up the whole tube. Okay, and then I found this on clearance. I don't know why I'm like showing you up close like you have never seen a water bottle in your life. This is a Pogo brand, it's 12 quart. It was $5, normally 10, so 50% off. Um, mathematician, just saying. Uh, but Wentworth, okay, love these water bottles with a straw. All of the water bottles we have are like girl themed, <laughs> like princess and all that stuff, purple and pink and whatever. So he needs his own like boy style water bottle, just saying. Oh, I also bought him a hat because he always likes to wear hats, but again, he has Mickey hats, but so we bought him a Toy Story hat. It was like $9, not so bad. Also found this Animal Crossing official sticker book. Yes, for $3.88, normally $13. And um, I just think Wentworth will enjoy this. Eleanor might enjoy that as well. I got a lot of cards. I use these cards for my work. They're really pretty. Cute little thank you cards. And then I thought I would get thank you cards to send to you guys because I am running low. And so I picked up some kitty cat ones. I stink and love kitty cats. I don't know if you know that about me. We used to have two cats. They were in our wedding. Yes, we were those crazy cat people. Uh, and then Alex found out he was like deathly allergic to everything except for cockroaches. Not an exaggeration. So sadly, we had to pass along our cats and get rid of like everything in our diets for like five years. Okay, um, what is this? Hand sanitizer spray. Oh, you guys. I don't know why I sprayed the air. I could have just sprayed my hands. I love this stuff. I love this stuff so much. The scent is fantastic. I think I get like coconut and lemon. Is that what it says? The brand is everyone. I also have this in body lotion. And I was at Home Goods the other day. I found it on sale. The, um, oh, words are so hard to put together these days. I found the body wash. I didn't buy it. Why didn't I buy it? I don't know. I'm regretting my life choices. I should have bought it. It was on sale even. No, I'm an idiot. Uh, so there's that. I also found this on clearance. Normally $7. I got it for like $4.90, almost five bucks or something. Yes. So I'm thinking of like Christmas gift stocking stuffers already, you know what I mean? And they had like some eyeshadow palettes, like little mini ones. Is this what an eyeshadow palette looks like? <laughs> I'm trying to make a square, rectangle even. This is getting ridiculous. <laughs> they had little ones and they were called like Slam Book and I thought, oh, my kids, do they need that? Do they even want it? And then later today I had a conversation with Avelina and she was like, I love eyeshadow. I just like to, and I was like, oh, should have bought some for her, for her stocking stuffer. But those were on mega clearance too. So if you're looking, I also got some toilet paper. Really cap. This is toothpaste. And did you know that Target no longer sells whatever this toothpaste is? Cause I can't think of it. I think it's like, it starts with an A. Aquafresh, is that it? Holy crap, why do I remember that and nothing else? They don't sell it anymore. So I picked this up, but they still sell it online. So I ordered it online, so it's gonna come in soon. I also got this little cleaning brush, just because when I'm cleaning my bathtubs, this thing is like so mini. It's like not even the size of my hand, you know what I mean? When I'm cleaning my bathtubs, it's hard for me to get into all the little crevices, so I thought this would be great. However, this was like three bucks, and I'm pretty sure you could find one at the Dollar Tree for, of course, a dollar. I think the ones at the Dollar Tree are a little bit bigger. I don't know. I haven't been there in forever. I also got some itch cream. Mosquito season. They freaking love my kids, the mosquitoes. And I read that if your diet is high in dairy, that the mosquitoes are attracted to you even more so. I don't believe that to be true because even when our family was completely dairy free and casein free, they still attacked us. So there's that. I also got some eye drops. 
Oh my gosh, did you guys know that if you have like chronic dry eye, so I had plugs in the tear ducts in my eyes. I had plugs put in because my eyes are like, ugh, so many problems. I don't even want to get into it with you. But um, my plugs kept falling out like every six to eight months. And it's just a hassle to go to the doctor, to go to the eye optometrist, whatever, to get them put in. Get, I have to go to my doctor and get the referral to go see the ophthalmologist to wait four hours and 17 months to actually be seen. Anyway, short story long, I got some eye drops because I don't feel like going to the doctor. I also needed sheet protectors for my job. It's so exciting. Oh, washable paint because Wentworth went with me. He also wanted all the glue and basically everything he sees he like wants to put in the cart. Oh, and a couple more things. Funfetti cake mix. It's almost Halloween. So um, we're having, we have a themed family get together once a month and we haven't gotten together. This weekend is our get together month. So I figured I would make these. I think our theme is Halloween. I'm gonna have to double check because I don't remember. And then I got this nursing top. Who would? I got a size medium. I don't, maybe I shouldn't have done that. But they didn't have a large. <laughs> and it was on clearance, normally $17. I got it for $8.50. So I thought, I mean, I nurse my babies forever anyway. So I figure even if I can only wear this when I'm like farther along postpartum, it'll st I'll still get use out of it. And then I want to organize, ah, uh -huh, it's falling. My kids' uh, closet, my girls' closet, it's just a disaster. The very top shelf is so hard to reach and their winter clothes are, I need to organize in there, short story long. So I bought four bins to do so. And I haven't seen these like less expensive bins at Target before. I'm trying to show you the brand. I'm not sure if it's working out. It's called Easy Y Storage. All right, and these are little containers. They come with lids and they were, I wanna say like $4 or $5. No, I hope they weren't five. Were they? But the ones that I bought from Ikea were like two or three dollars and then you had to spend a dollar on the lid and they're smaller than this. So I thought I was getting a good deal and I also didn't need to drive to Ikea, which I think I'm going to go there soon anyway to just to do like a shop with me for their Christmas stuff because it's always so fun to go there. Whoo, I'm sweating. But at least I got to wear my pretty Blue floral top, hmm. If only for 20 minutes to hang out with you guys. But that's it, oh wait, that's not it. <laughs> tricked you. That's almost it, I got some gravy packets. I got some tuna fish. This isn't tuna fish, I got some salmon. <laughs> A tuna fish sandwich. And then I got these beef sticks. I don't know what I was thinking to be quite honest with you. And then I got 17 boxes of the raisins that we love, the sour raisins, because they were on clearance. They're normally $3.69. I got them for a dollar seventy-eight. Thank you. So I picked all of them up except for one. They still have the grape and strawberry at my store, like a lot of them. But these are our favorite flavor. Oh god, words. Anyway, so I snagged them up. Guys, I have not had a kid come over our house who hasn't enjoyed those. I know some people don't like them. They taste like candy. They're so good. I want to, can't smell them through the box, but I want to eat them right now. No sugar added. They do add like citric acid to it, obviously, to make it sour. No GMOs, no artificial flavors, no synthetic colors. Say what? It's magic. I don't know what they do. Raisins are already nature's candy, and they just made it better. Just saying. All right. That is everything, right? Right? Am I right? It's probably not, but that's okay. That's all I'm gonna share with you. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this like uh, random haul of goodies from Target. I hope you enjoyed it. Hope you enjoyed hanging out with me. I always enjoy my time with you. If you wanna subscribe, put a little more happy in your day and I'll see you next time. Bye.